at Toyota. Safety isn't an option, it's standard. So features like lane departure alert and pre-collision system are always included on every single Toyota RAV4. To get similar features on a road, Nissan charges over $6,000. They shouldn't, we don't. Just announced, get $3,000 cash back on a new 2018 Toyota RAV4. For other great deals, visit your Toyota dealer today or find your Toyota at toyota.com. Toyota, let's go places.
I buy in bulk. So do I. Jag tar med mitt eget godis när jag går på bio. I still use my parents' TV login. Saving is in style. Start saving with the Anywhere account today. At Toyota, safety isn't an option. It's standard. So features like lane departure alert and pre-collision system are always included on every single Toyota RAV4. To get similar features on a road, Nissan charges over $6,000. They shouldn't. We don't. Just announced, get $3,000 cash back on a new 2018 Toyota RAV4. For other great deals, visit your Toyota dealer today. Or find your Toyota at toyota.com. Toyota, let's go places. At Toyota, safety isn't an option.
I cut my own hair. I buy in bulk. So do I. Jag tar med mitt eget godis när jag går på bio. I still use my parents' TV login. Saving is in style. Start saving with the Anywhere account today. At Toyota, safety isn't an option, it's standard. So features like lane departure alert and pre-collision system are always included on every single Toyota RAV4. To get similar features on a road, Nissan charges over $6,000. They shouldn't, we don't. Just announced, get $3,000 cash back on a new 2018 Toyota RAV4. For other great deals, visit your Toyota dealer today or find your Toyota at toyota.com. Toyota, let's go places.
Watson going outside off the net. Phelps able to send it over. That ball touch call off the block, so play will continue. And a kill for Hilbert. Hoffman with the pass on that ball. Outside of Phelps. High swing down the line, but picked up by Kopp. Hilbert just trickling off the top of the net. Phelps with another swing. This one dropping short, but Hilbert's there. Sent over by Couch. Quick ball set in the middle to Scott. Hilbert with another swing, but it's blocked. Looked like a little net movement. Couldn't tell what side, but nothing's called. So play will continue. Back row to Griman, roll shot. Larson digs it. Sent over by Mays. This rally, everyone is on their toes. Who's going to give it up? Down the line and a lift called against Larson. Nice little trick play there from Scott, only a sophomore. Going for that deep tip down the line. One of my favorite plays from any position. Nice job by both teams, though. Great heads-up defense. Phelps with the serve. Hilbert gets blocked. Larson's there. This one to Griman. She's blocked, but dug up by Kennis. Swan with another swing, and Kennis there to cover again. Griman changes it up with the roll shot. Free ball going to the Wizards. Just keeping it alive. And that one goes long. Griman not quite there with her feet. Looked like a miscommunication between Garrett and Griman on what the set was going to be. It's interesting to see as the Wizards start throwing in more roll shots, more tips, the Lobos don't quite know what to do. They're great with those hard driven balls, but being able to read the hands of their hitters, not so much. And there's a block from Hilbert and Kaufman. Lobos now closest they've been within one. And it goes long. And that just hurts those free points when you're trying to make a comeback. Just frustrating. Exactly. For coaching staff. Especially when Hertzke's back in the front row for the Wizards. She's been doing a great job for them. Going outside to Hertzke, tips it over, and there she is. Smart play by Gabby Hertzke. It's almost as if the Lobos cannot read where she is going to hit or tip or shoot the ball. Everything's dropping for her. Cop out of the back row, dug up by Scott. Grimey with the kill. Wizards now getting that lead back a little bit, up by four. Great serve from the sophomore. Hilbert on the outside, blocked by Garrett, but covered. Hilbert with another swing. Oh, and Kenneth into the top of the tape. Again, I can't say it enough, great defense by both of these teams. We are not having many one-swing rallies. Young back into the front row for the Lobos. Mays with the serve. Dropping short, what a serve. That ball dropped and curved. Hard for Hoffman to get her platform on. Coach Houston going to pull Hoffman out of the passing lanes, put Griman back there. Kinnis with the pass. Griman gets the swing, but cops there. And yet another block for the Wizards, this time Griman and Garrett. Garrett back to the service line, leading by three. Painting 
that line, ace Ellie Garrett. Garrett trying for the same spot. This time, Cops able to handle it. Hilbert with a swing off the top of the block, but a great up by Hoffman. <laughs> Just threw her, threw her fist out there. And Hoffman charging on that one. Can't quite get the same touch. That's a kill for Hilbert. Point Lobos. Hilbert rotating back to serve for Rocky Mountain. Hoffman with the pass, sending this ball outside to Kenneth. Just a roll shot. And a quick play there. Kill Hannah Kaufman. Hilbert with another serve here. Now within two. Kinnis takes a swing off the top of the block. Cop digs it and she'll take a swing as well. Also off the top of the block, but this one drops. Another point for the Lobos, closing that gap again. We'll see if they can hold on and tie it up this time. Winter's done a good job of when Rocky gets this close, get that second breath of air and finishing it as they did in the second set. Exactly, just like that. It's a big swing from Allie Kinnis. Griman back to serve. Hop gets that ball in the court, but is hopping around a little bit. Might need a second to stretch out her ankle. Don't know if she came down on someone's foot. It's like a referee timeout, just making sure that Cop's okay. Don't know <laughs> necessarily yeah. why the discussion's necessarily <laughs> necessary, excuse me, but maybe just. Maybe using it as a timeout. <laughs> see if she can walk around or not. And it looks like Cop like will ankle. go ahead and take a seat. It did look like an ankle from how she was moving around. Great teammates there carrying her off. Those ankles are not fun to deal with. No, not nope. fun to come back from. Any injury, really. Once you roll it once, too, especially in the middle of the season, it'll, it'll just go on you. <laughs> it will. Yeah, exactly. Larson will serve now. Somehow that ball's up and not going to quite get back over, so point for the Wizards. Windsor started celebrating and they froze for a second. <laughs> Just double check. They didn't think that ball could get up either. And it looks like with that, Coach Gainley will take a timeout. 
We'll go ahead and take one with him. Back here at Rocky Mountain High School, Hoffman at the service line. That one goes long. Timeout worked well for Rocky. Couch subbing in for Young and she'll serve. Griman out of the back row of Doug by Hilbert. And the rally continues. Kenneth throws that one into the net. As soon as the Lobos think they're about to tie it. They do. They do. <laughs> Wrong team. <laughs> On the scoreboard, the scoreboard <laughs> tricked me up. I was just trying to be funny. It was very funny. <laughs> That ball drops in, just pinning the line there is Scott. Nice save as well from Garrett on that tight pass. Kinnis to serve now within three of taking this set. Oh, that ball called out. Again, we are a little ways up here, but that ball <laughs> looked a little in. Lobos tied up again. It's gotta be a tough position being one of those line judges. It is, the game moves pretty quickly. But even the up refs can overrule the line judges. Either way, Coach Houston will call a timeout and we will be back to bring you the end of this third set. At Toyota, safety isn't an option, it's standard. So features like lane departure alert and pre-collision system are always included on every single Toyota RAV4. To get similar features on a road, Nissan charges over $6,000. They shouldn't, we don't. Just announced, get $3,000 cash back on a new 2018 Toyota RAV4. For other great deals, visit your Toyota dealer today or find your Toyota at toyota.com. Toyota, let's go places. Lobos will take over serving, all tied up, 22-22 here in the third. Lots of high swings going off the top of the block. Hilbert this time off the side, gets a tool off Garrett. Lobos making that comeback. Swan with the serve. Scott able to make that ball drop. She's been swinging from every spot in the court, outside, middle, right side, and getting plenty of kills. Great dig by Phelps. And that ball goes long. Point Wizards. We got a nail biter here, folks. It is set point for the Wizards. 
Phelps back there serving. Oh, miscommunication between Garrett and Scott. Lobo's tied up yet again. Out of system, outside to Griman. Roll shot over the block. Oh, Lobo is able it. to dig it up. And another kill for Scott. What a swing. Can they put it away now? Court. What an angle. Mays serving for the Lobos. Again, all tied up here, 25-25. Overpass. Free ball for the Lobos, and Hilbert takes advantage. Now set point for the Lobos. Wizards have controlled the majority of this set. Just a few key plays for the Lobos, got him right back in it. Coach Houston gonna try to slow that momentum with a timeout. After that, we will be back for the end of this exciting third set. We're back, Mays serving for the Lobos. Set point after a great comeback so far. And that ball goes long. A little bit too excited on the overpass. Windsor ties it up yet again. Another kill for Miles Hilbert carrying this Lobos team. And with that swing, she will be the next server serving set point. And the ball is long. Wow. A lot of adrenaline for Miles Hilbert there after having so many kills. Griman at the service line for the Wizard. She's done a nice job this evening as well.
Nice coverage there by Larson. Tipped over, almost drops Garrett's there. Kinnis with another deep tip, picked up by Hilbert. Lots of tips here in this rally, so but not some more timing. great defense. And that's what happens with these long rallies. You want to be aggressive, but you want to be smart at the same time. Hertzke with a swing, and it's out. No touches called. That's a point for the Lobos, and yet again, set point. Larson with the serve. Kinnis bringing down the hammer. Hoffman with the ace. Wizards take back control, and now it is their set point. Trickling off the top, uh -oh. Larson able to get a hand on it. Hilbert sends it over, and it's wide. That is another set in the books for the Wizards, but folks, that's not it. We still have a full another set to play if the Wizards want to run away with this match. What an amazing set by both teams. Just a grind. It was. Not many mistakes there in the second, kind of the second half of that match. It was. That there set. were quite a few mistakes, but at the same time, both teams were being very smart and very competitive. It was fun volleyball to watch. But with that, the Wizards are ahead two sets to one. We'll come back on Stream at Sports to bring you the fourth and potentially final set. I cut my own hair. I buy in bulk. So do I. I take my own good when I go to bio. I still use my parents' TV login. Saving is in style. Start saving with the Anywhere account today.
And we are back here at Rocky Mountain High School in the fourth set. Last one, a nail-biter. 30-28. Wizards able to pull it off in the end. They were ahead by quite a great deal for the majority of the set. But then the Lobos made an amazing fight back. We'll see if that was too deflating for the Lobos to come back from losing in a close one or if they're ready to roll. They also still have Kaylee Kopp on the bench after suffering an ankle injury. So that would be slightly detrimental potentially for the Lobos. Garrett will start with a serve. Hilbert with the tip, picked up by Phelps. And down ref calling four, but up ref doesn't see it. She thinks there's a touch on that block. Kinnis with the tip and it goes wide. Ooh, just Point Lobos. Rough timing there on the jump. It was a little bit. You could see where she was trying to go. It was an open spot, but just a little bit wide. Young into the set. Mays serving for the Lobos. Ryman with the cross court kill. Ryman now rotating back to serve for the Wizards. That one dropping out of system now for the Lobos. Kinnis got a little bit under that one. So it goes long. Good idea though. High risk, high reward shot. Exactly, and a lot of those she has been connecting on, just a little off on that approach. Hilbert serving for the Lobos. Kenneth's trying to cut that one back across the block, but Kaufman cuts her off. That ball very deep. <laughs> Just landing directly in the corner. Nice little shot there for Moyer. Hoffman with a serve. Free ball, we'll see if the Wizards can capitalize and Kenneth does. She just elevates so high when she jumps, it's just tough to compete with. She does. Hoffman serving again. Just a trickler off the top. Hilbert gets the kill. Just how she drew it up. Larson back to serve. Down the line and she gets the ace. We'll see if she can do it again here. Aiming for that line and goes deep. I have a feeling this one could go down to extra points here once again. It could, both teams firing on all cylinders. Kinnis with a dirty serve. And that ball. That, yep, I was about to say that. <laughs> and that is where the up ref can overrule the line judge, so a kill for Moyer. And that's tough, that line judge had to move. But that up ref can just watch the ball. <laughs> exactly. And that ball into the top of the net. Point Lobos. Couch at the service line. 
Hoffman with a great pass. Moyer taking another swing. Larson's able to pick it up. Hilbert out of the back row, dug by Griman. Moyer with another swing. Larson's there. And that ball, no touch. Four contacts, so point for the Wizards. Phelps with the serve. That one had a lot of movement, but handled nicely by Hilbert. And there's a kill from Warning. Haven't seen that in a little bit. But when she does touch the ball, it's almost always a kill. Out of system. And that ball is just wide. Garrett getting a lot of great touches, typically into the court. But that one goes out of bounds. Point Lobos. And neither team has gotten over a two-point lead here in this. No, and that is something that is unique to this fourth set. Early on in the other three sets, one team or the other has taken a great lead at the beginning. This one has been very back and forth. And the Lots power of, of broadcasting, swings. they get the first <laughs> two-point lead. That ball drops in. A Sydney Swan. Griman with a swing picked up by Larson. Miles taking a hack. Hoffman touches it, just a free ball sent over for the Lobos. Quick swing from Warning. Not ball goes wide. Another point for the Lobos. Now up by four. This is one of those big spreads we were talking about that we saw a lot of in those first three sets. Down the line from Griman. Nice pickup by Couch. Larson out of the back row. Dug by Kinnis, it's tight. And a kill for Emma Werning. <laughs> Touched slightly by Phelps, so an ace for Swan. About six straight points, I believe, for the Lobos. They have gone on quite the run. Swan doing a nice job back there at the service line. Off-speed shot picked up by Larson. Hilbert on the outside, and that one goes long. Thought they got the touch, but that's a no, so point Wizards. Tipped over by Hertzke and it falls. We've seen that tip from her a couple times, doing a nice job. 
just getting right over the block and falling behind it. Too high for the blockers to touch, but too short for the defender to dive for. And that one's in the net. Trying to mark your comeback, had two straight points. And once again, one of those kind of just free points to give away there. It is, those frustrating ones where you know it's all in your control. Hilbert with yet another kill. I always say this, I wish we had stats up here. I can only keep tally of so much myself, but I would love to know how many kills Miles Hilbert has this evening. Nice block there from Hilbert. Outside to Hertzke, that tip again and yet again. It falls in front of that right back defender, in this case, Couch. It doesn't have to be pretty. It doesn't have to be an amazing swing. If it's going to fall and it's going to score, go for it at this point. That ball goes wide. Mays serving for the Lobos. Kinnis a little bit of an off-speed shot, but still great placement and get a free ball back. And she'll get another shot at it, but picked up by Swan. And a double called against Mays. Windsor hoping to start their comeback right here. Still down by five. And they've kind of struggled to get, you know, more than three points in a row here. They have, We've especially, seen a lot of yeah, in this set. Hilbert off the block. Nice little split serve there from Hilbert. Gets a free ball back. And unfortunately, uh, excuse me, Kaufman sends that into the top of the net. But nice serve from Miles Hilbert. Hoffman with a serve for the Wizards. Larson thinks it's out, but it drops. Ace, Holly Hoffman. And Hoffman put enough air on that to make it really look like it was going to go out. So. She did. It just dropped there at the last second. <laughs> Dug up there by Grime and Kinnis with a deep tip and a net call against the Lobos. So double point for the Wizards. Wait, there's double points? Interestingly enough, there's not, but wouldn't that be funny? Why would you lead the people astray? <laughs> I just like to confuse everyone. <laughs> and I know we have smart listeners. <laughs> Roll shot picked up by Scott. And another kill for Moyer. Moyer pretty quiet in the first three sets. Picked up her game here in the fourth and getting a lot more balls. Sub for the Lobos as the Wizards have come within two. Back row, Larson with the roll shot and the kill. With that, Larson will head back to the service line. Moyer gets blocked on that one. Werning 
Solo block. Scott on the outside, and she kills it down the line. Great placement there. When they're not going out without a fight. Not at Even though all. they're winning the whole. <laughs> <laughs> Lobo's just trying to match them. I'm sure they don't want to risk it going to a fifth set, so they're going to fight as hard as they can for this fourth. A lot more missed serves from the Wizards than we've seen throughout this match. Trying to stay aggressive down the lines. Scott takes another big hack. This one Larson picks up. Hilbert out of the back row, and that one goes in the net. Haven't seen a ton of errors from Hilbert this evening. Phelps serving for the Wizards. That ball gets through the block. Point Lobos. Swan coming in to serve. Up by four. Starting to inch their way towards the end of this fourth set. Griman on the outside and she gets blocked. Mays and Werning with the block for Rocky Mountain. Now creating that wider spread of five points. Coach Houston doesn't like it. She'll call a timeout. We'll be right back on Stream It Sports. I still use my parents' TV login. Saving is in style. Start saving with the Anywhere account today. At Toyota, safety isn't an option, it's standard. So features like lane departure alert and pre-collision system are always included on every single Toyota RAV4. To get similar features on a road, Nissan charges over $6,000. They shouldn't, we don't. Just announced, get $3,000 cash back on a new 2018 Toyota RAV4. For other great deals, visit your Toyota dealer today. Or find your Toyota at toyota.com. Toyota, let's go places. Rocky Mountain getting Windsor out of system on that first serve out of the timeout. Setting Hilbert up for a big swing. Now within three of sending us to a fifth set. Swan with the serve. Griman tipping it over, taking a play out of Hertzke's book and it works. Stopping the bleeding there. Scott with a deep serve, fought off by Hilbert. Hilbert over the line. Wizards able to keep it alive. And Werning, high swing over the block. And now Werning will go back to the service line. Can they put it away, the final two points? Wow. Finally pick up that tip. Trying it again. 
but not twice in a row. Windsor staying alive. We'll see if Garrett can go on a little bit of a run here, get some of those points back. Hilbert gives the Wizards a taste of their own medicine, tipping it right over the block. Set point here for the Lobos. Mays with the serve. It's deep and it's in. And with that, we will be going to a fifth set. Great fight from both teams. That's the Lobos we saw in the first set, going on nice long runs, keeping their composure, t playing great defense, and putting the ball away. It's been an exciting night, folks, and it's not over yet. When we come back, we will have the fifth and for sure final set.
And we're back here at Rocky Mountain High School, starting off with an ace for the Lobos from Mays. Mays going for it again. This one deep, and it'll work. Two aces in a row to start off the fifth set for Mays. You only got 15 in this set. I was just going to say, quick reminder, only to 15. Cody's on top of it. I know my rules. Only after four or five years that <laughs> I got this one down. Hertzke with the kill. Garrett back at the service line. Off the top of the block, but picked up by Hoffman. Free ball for the Lobos. Hilbert with the swing. Griman able to get a hand on it. Hilbert will go for it again, and she's blocked. That's Kinnis and Hertzke with the block. I feel like whoever wins this is not going to be by very large margin. I believe you are right. We've had quite the close match. Garrett with another serve there. And Hilbert with yet another swing. This one's a kill. Hilbert back to serve for the Lobos. Somehow saved by Garrett, but sent out of bounds. Point Lobos. Kenneth trying to roll shut that through the inside of the block, but it is shut down by Kaufman. Lobo's up by three in a short set like this. That's quite the spread. Dropper from Hilbert, handled nicely by Phelps, tipped over, picked up by Mays. Grimer with a big swing, but it's blocked. And here's Hertzke, picked up by Hilbert. Great blocks on both sides of the net right now. Teams pressing, controlling themselves. We haven't seen a lot of nets called. Great hustle by the Lobos, keeping this ball alive. Kinnis is blocked. Point Lobos, great block by Kaufman after some nice hustles from her back row. Man, that can just take the energy out of you if you're Windsor. It <laughs> can. a great possession. They go all out and save it and then come back to take the point. And especially long rallies like that, you want to be able to pull those off. They give you so much momentum going into the next point. Hertzke with the swing picked up by Mays. And that one's into the net. Windsor getting that ball back. And Griman serving. And that ball goes long. Another point for the Wizards. Making their comeback. And yet another ball goes long. Lobo's looking for the touch. They're not going to get it. Point Wizards. And 
Hot balls into the net. Wizards going on a nice little run here. Now within one. Coach Gainley trying to replace that vacant spot of cop. Putting in different swingers up from JV. Obviously haven't had as much experience. Just trying to fight to find their place. Tight ball and that's in the net. Wizards take the lead. And with that, Coach Gainley will take a timeout. We'll go ahead and take it with him. After playing the, the game for many years, and I decided I could either watch from the couch or get on the field and become part of the game. I became a judge because it was a natural transition from being a gymnast to coach, now judge. I love the large crowds, the excitement of the game, and you know what? I got the best seat in the house. Help these kids. Help this community. Become an official. Griman serving for the Wizards out of the timeout. She got an ace last time. This one at least over, tight pass. Scramble play, and the Lobos will come away with it. Larson serving, all tied up 7-7 here in the fifth. Deep tip, Ooh, nice run down by Hilbert. Looked like it was going out. Larson out of the back row, dug by Hoffman. Kinn is taking a big swing off the top of the block. It'll trickle down to the middle of the court. Point, Windsor Wizards. Back row from Hoffman, and it's in the net. We knew this was going to come down to the end. Couch serving. Lobo's taking a big swing on that free ball, but Griman's there. Scott able to speed up to that set, but it's dug by Larson. No shortage of long rallies in this match. Kinnis with a big swing, bouncing off Hilbert's shoulder. And they take the lead back, 9-8. Scott on the outside, dug by Hilbert. This time going to Moyer, and that'll drop. Looks like a little bit of a miscommunication there. They both dove and I think kind of let up at the last second. It was, that's happened between the two of them a lot tonight. Couch and Larson, both such athletic players so fast, but they don't want to run into each other. That one a touch called on the block, but Scott puts it down. Wizards will get the point. And 
And with that, the Lobos take a timeout. Don't want the Wizards to get too much of a lead here. They're closing in on this fifth set and the match. We'll be right back on Stream It Sports. And here we are, Kinnis at the back line for the Wizards with a three-point lead. Again, trying to take away this fifth set and the match. Roll shot, and the Lobos get the point. Swan serving for the Lobos. This one going outside, and it's another kill what a swing. for Scott. I would never have guessed that Sarah Scott is a sophomore based on the way she is playing tonight. One of the top go-to players for the Wizards. Three more points. Can they get there? Phelps serving. Quick little set to Warning, picked up by Kinnis. Scott, who else to get the kill for the Wizards? I believe it was Rocky who was winning this set for a while. They made a great run at the beginning. And Windsor ke keeps their composure, takes the lead. Exactly how this whole evening's been going. Grima with a big swing, but of course Scott the one to take Great it over. Great effort though. Scott gonna go again. And she gets the kill. What a placement. Now set and match point for the Wizards. Phelps at the service line. Deep ball, tight pass, and Scott puts it away. I mean, both teams playing amazing defense, amazing offense, but Sarah Scott, four for four at the end of that match, a sophomore dominating the net. Amazing job by her. Great job by Miles Hilbert on the other side of the net, putting away most of the ball she was set. Again, long rallies, which is a sign of great defense by both teams. So really couldn't have asked for any better volleyball tonight in Northern Colorado. I appreciate you all for joining us. It was a fun evening. For Cody McCoy, I'm Samantha Peters. We will see you next time on Stream It Sports. It's Northern Colorado High School Volleyball, live on Stream It Sports NOCO. This broadcast has been brought to you by Jim's Wings, Northern Colorado's favorite wings since 1991. By Peterson Toyota in Fort Collins, everything cars made easy. And by First Bank. Visit any of our convenient locations in Northern Colorado. First Bank, banking for good.